Hey everybody, it's Janet with Be Blessed Health and Fitness. Good morning. Wanted to jump on here, give you a little Monday motivation to get moving and start your week off right. I just finished my workout for 25 minutes and I'm getting ready to do my extra challenge. I've got an arm challenge actually running right now um, in my accountability group for 30 days. And for 30 days, we are progressively um, increasing the number of reps that we do in three moves, bicep, curls, chair dips, and push-ups. So if you want definition, these extra challenges are the way to do it. Um, and I'm gonna do, so today I'm supposed to do 42 push-ups, 65 chair dips, and 120 bicep curls. That may seem like a ton of reps, but let me tell you that this is week four. So I've been doing this for three weeks, progressively working up. I think we started with six push-ups. So six push-ups, now we've got 42. Um, and I don't do them all at once, so I'm doing some circuits. So I might do 20 push-ups and then do 20 chair dips and 20 bicep curls and then repeat. Um, so I wanted to show you just a little bit about what this group is doing. I wanted to show you just one circuit. I'm not gonna, not gonna make you watch me do the whole thing. But um, just a real quick, if you wanted to do this challenge at home, let's do push-ups with proper form. I'll just kinda show you. Hands directly under your shoulders. Back straight, butt tucked under. Legs straight. Now you can modify with your knees down. Um, if you need to, I would challenge you to do as many as you can on your hands. So I'm just gonna do one set here. We got 20 push ups. Moving on to chair dips. I'm going to see if I can do 20. And I'm actually using a table. You can use whatever you need as long as your legs are out straight, your butt can kind of dip down, and you're pushing with your arms and not your legs. If you don't have arm strength and you're starting out, you can start with your legs bent. It takes a little bit of pressure off your arms, makes it a little bit easier. So we'll just do 20 of these. And then we've got bicep curls. I'm just gonna do one set. And I'm gonna do it down here so you guys can see me. But really just elbows at your sides, bring the weights up and down. I'm using 10 pound weights, you could use five pound weights, you could do three pound weights. Gotta start somewhere. And sometimes I find when I get to the end of my reps that I can't do both arms at once. So I will alternate one each. It takes a little bit of pressure off. So that's my arm challenge. And like I said, it's progressively, um, working up progressively every day for 30 days. Um, and I could give you that challenge and you could do it at home. Absolutely, you could do it on your own. The difference when you're in an accountability group is the motivation and support and encouragement. So left to do that on my own without anyone to report into or anyone checking up on me, I probably wouldn't do it. I wouldn't finish it, I wouldn't do it every day. But when I run these challenge groups, these accountability groups, there's a group of people who have similar goals, who are supporting each other and encouraging each other you know, as the coach, I am providing 
motivation and um, encouragement every day along with um, any other coaches that may be co-running a group with me and you know there's support from the other community members and it's all online virtual you can be anywhere in the world doing this and you feel like you have a group that has your back a support group that is with you every step of the way we post our struggles we post our wins we share questions and tips and honestly it is the key to success I mean I attempted to do workout programs from home for a long time and I was never able to stick with them the way that I wanted to until I found challenge groups and a support community that was able to encourage me and keep me showing up every day. So that's the key to, to my success um, and just making sure that I am getting that you know at least 30 minutes a day in with my workout program and then sometimes we add these little extra challenges this arm challenge is gonna take me at most 10 minutes today. And I did this challenge a year ago, and it's what started to give me this definition. The definition that I honestly thought I could never have, because I have never, ever, ever had definition in my arms. Even years ago when I lifted weights, my arms got bigger, but they didn't get defined. And uh, some of that was nutrition. I've learned a lot about how I eat since then. Um, some of it was just not doing the right things, and um, so the, the I've learned a lot since then, and it's and it's paid off. So results speak a thousand words, right? Um, so anyway, just wanted to share that with you—a little motivation this morning. I hope that you'll get moving today. It will start your day and your week off uh, in a great way, and I hope that you all have a wonderful day. Talk to you soon.